down and pull the beacon right there. We'll get as many of you guys in here as we can. Got the health. Not kill these guys down. Oh my god. Hello everyone, Blaine Sarge here. Welcome back to some more Dawn of War 2 Chaos Rising. So in the last episode, if you guys missed it, there will be a little pop-up in the top right of your screen. I highly recommend you guys go check it out. Uh, so we were over here on the second location on the Judgment of Carrion. And uh, yeah, not only did we get some more gear and some more experience, but we also got a few more hints of who the traitor is. Um, but we still haven't yet to find out who it is. So we're, we're tr still trying to figure that out. Um, but we ended the last episode finding out there is two locations under attack currently at the moment. So we're going to head to Meridian and see what kind of help we can help these guys out with. Because it looks like they only have one more day left and it is an optional mission. Um, so, of course, we're going to do the optional mission. Let's do it. Traveling to Meridian. Uh, remember, if you guys are enjoying the series and you want to see a lot more, remember to smash and destroy that like button. Leave a comment down below. Let me know you guys are enjoying it. And I sound... <clears throat> oh, here we go. Ah, so things are kicking off already. Um, and like I was about to say... If I sound a little groggy, I literally just woke up about 30 minutes ago and recording this. So if I sound a little tired, I do apologize. I'm going to try not to be. All right. Um, yeah, let's do this. Uh, we'll see what the honor guard has to say first. This is Captain Diomedes. All blood ravens are to cease crusade recruitment and other operations within the Aurelian sector. What? Return to your muster points and prepare for mobilization to the Ferox Rift Crusade. Knowledge is power. Guard it well. He abandons the sector so easily. How can we follow such a man? We are receiving another priority signal from Captain Angelos. Commander, we must not abandon this sector to the traitor legions. I am headed to Calderas to discuss the matter with Diomedes. Continue to oppose the Black Legion. Right? I'm gonna listen to out. I would listen to Angelos. Damn straight, and we can't. Yay! The Space Marines—they can't run away from the spa uh, the traitors. Come on now. The master of scribes found this message. He came to me. He did not know whom else to trust. You must get Diomedes to put a leash on Angelos. He still has us chasing them, and that is putting me at great risk. I am not the only one who will be discovered if it comes to that. Do you understand me, Galen? Knowledge is power, as you are also fond of saying. This was sent to Calderas. What? And the Honor Guard. Corruption worms its way into the chapter's heart. You must stand against this. So someone in the honor guard is the tr is not only a traitor, but someone in our midst as well. Holy crap! Well, that was a plot twist. All right, let's see what we're going to be going up against here. Commander, praise Terra, you have come. The Vandis heretics and the Black Legion are overrunning Capital Spire itself. We still hold the Imperial Palace, but they have taken the rest of the Spire. I will die before surrendering the palace to these treasonous curs. Without your aid, Blood Ravens, I will make good on that pledge before long. Okay. You have brought us key victories, Commander, but we have been fighting a hundred other battles. The 85th Vendalant and my other loyal troops have all suffered massive casualties. The Black Legion, however, never seems to run out of madmen and demons to throw against us. Loyal forces are converging on Capital Spire, but they will not be here in time to make a difference. So that's why you need us. And uh, I'm guessing this allow this mission to expire, which means if we don't beat it, uh, all squads get corrupted. Nice! Not really. That would suck. All right. So since we're going to be doing defensive mission, 
Um, yeah, I want to bring him because he has a new ability. Um, kind of, it's a healing aura around him, so we're gonna bring that. Uh, so we'll bring him. He's good. Um, of course, we're bringing uh, Avitus, and then we're bringing Tarkus, and then of course him. Um, I'm starting to wonder: Would it be better if I drop these? Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna do that before I even answered. Um. drop these down yeah these are nice but i can also use these as better for defense all right let's do it shall we do we have any anti-armor just in case no we don't really uh, um yeah we'll have to pray on that one <laughs> uh yeah okay let's do it Let's get in there. Commander, Do it! So it looks like we might be getting some guardsmen backing us up, which is not a lot. Um, but yeah, we just have to hold the line, I guess. For how long? I have no idea. Um, but yeah, capital defense. Let's do it. Alright, let's do this. Looks like those guardsmen need our help, boys. Let's get in there quickly. Attention. This is Governor Elena De Rosa. The Blood Ravens are here. Damn the straight we are. Those angels of death fight with us. Alright. Drive the Banner, traitors get from right the in there. Gates. Avatis, I want you right here. You guys right in front of them. Let's do this. Oh yeah, we're mowing them down. Yeah. Let's knock it down a few tanker boys. Use the power of the warp. Marcus, come up here. And grab this. Destroy them. Come on. We need medical supplies. Repositioning. Let them do their thing. Come on, grab those. I mean, okay, I guess we have what we have. And we're gonna have to deal with. Where, where is Jonah? Oh, dude, seriously? You worried? Knock him down, dude. He has the power of the warp. Use it. Goodbye. The palace is safe, thanks to your Blood Ravens, Commander. The Black Legion will not give up so easily, Governor. Prepare for a counterattack. Commander, I Here have several torrential turrets ready to deploy. Bayonets! Use the bloody bayonets! <laughs> bayonets! Use the bloody bayonets! Yeah, no kidding. Fortifications are under assault. Alright. So you 
guys come over here, help them out. You go over there. All right, we just got to hold. That's it. We just got to defend this ground. And that's exactly what we're going to do. What? Still trying to figure out how that happened. I thought I thought he was going to come back. In fact, I know I gave the command. Use a stimulus pack to get you up, buddy. Cause I that's a lot of guys coming in. Guardsmen. Actually, I didn't realize you guys can drop mine. Let's go over here. The enemy still holds the communications array and Imperial Shrine below the plaza, however. A quick strike could retake them, Commander. Uh, in, mm hmm. Well, you know, will I gain corruption if I don't? That's a risk. Try to go after one. Let's go. Let's try. I'm gonna go after one of them. That's one thing for sure. I do want to put mines down. Try to grab this. I hope I'm gonna be okay. okay. Direct or not. Drive them back into the war. Oops, too soon, too soon, too soon. Seriously? You guys just gonna let him sit there taking pop shots? Well, if that's the case, I'm gonna put down some more mines. I don't feel like they're giving us these for a reason, so let's use it. not worth it right now. It really isn't. Might as well just hold the palace. Yeah, some heavy ordnance 
right here. Bring it down. Bring the pain. The enemy has massed for a counterattack on the palace. Stand with the Emperor and drive them back. Here we go. Commander, the palace will not hold without your aid. Brothers, we go. Guysman. Right here, pick you up. Oh my god. Seriously, how many of these things do we have? Shoot it, keep shooting it. Really, everybody just get in front of it. These tanks are a problem. No, 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 no. Ah, crap. He went in the wrong direction. Drop it right here. Drop it like it's hot, buddy. Hit it with everything we got. Just, just barely. You guys get over there, don't get close. We did it. Everybody just killed this thing. Holy crap. Oh, 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 wow. Thank you, Blood Ravens. Once again, you have saved Meridian. I have to say, if I were to try to go on, go on after one of those shrines, that would have not have been a thing. We would never have been able to hold that because I needed literally everybody so thankfully we didn't get any corruption right crush your fingers because we didn't capture any of those uh the shrine or the beacon please 
Okay, so no one got any corruption. Thank God. That's good. Uh, wow, that's a nice armor there. Um, but yeah, let's let's see what's gonna happen next, shall we? Got a message from Governor Derosa. Commander, I am forever in your debt. I cannot understand why Captain Angelos and Captain Diomedes refuse to aid us. But in our darkest times, against our most terrible foes, you stood with us. Meridian will never forget this. I will never forget. Wow. So, like, everybody is leveled up. We saved the capital. We didn't get any corruption. And somehow we survived that. Um, bef uh, before I end this episode, if you guys noticed how when we went into the battle, my uh, commander had claws and then suddenly he had an assault cannon that's because i went to record this and uh i got about halfway through and then something happened i had to leave came back and i was like you know what i'm gonna throw a salt cannon on there see what happens so i'm gonna do some editing um so you guys hopefully don't see that you guys technically would have known that if you guys if you, but you would have known if you were paying attention which I'm pretty sure a lot of you are. But I just thought I'd throw it out there so you guys know I wasn't cheating. I did have the restart, and I decided to give the guy an assault cannon. That's all that's happened. Nothing else. All right, so that's going to be the end of this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode as much as I did playing it. Um, and if you guys have any comments, suggestions, or feedback about this episode or this series, or you just guys want to talk about Warhammer 40K, let me know in the comment section down below. Also, if you guys have not already, you guys can go check out my Discord. Links for that will be in the description down below. Over there, you guys can talk with me, hang out with me, and other YouTubers and other gamers. It is awesome and loads of fun. Hopefully, you get to see you guys over there. Also, if you guys want to keep up to date what is going on with the channel, you guys can follow me on Twitter as well as my Discord. Again, links for those will be in the description down below. I keep everybody up to date what is going on, so check it out. Also, I would like to take a moment to say thank you so much to my Patreon supporters. Thank you guys so much for going the extra mile to help support the channel. It really means a lot to me. Every dollar does help, so if you want to help support the channel and help me bring more awesome content like this for you guys to enjoy, hit uh, check out my Patreon. Links for that will be in the description down below as well at the end of the video. Till next time, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care, guys, and remember, have an awesome day.